Otherwise, a lot of excitement and buzz surrounding the Dayton Dragons home opener tonight from fans and businesses as well, where the balls and strikes and wins and losses from the baseball stadium turn into dollars and cents at the cash register. Two News reporter Seth Bird talks with a local brewery and residents on the effect the Dragons have on business. The sun was shining and fans had smiles on their faces for the Dayton Dragons home opener. Though it's not just the fans who are excited, local bars and restaurants are ready for baseball season. Especially Lock 27, which is just a few steps away from the ballpark's entrance, making it a hot spot for fans looking to pregame. You know, there's nothing like getting the buzz, getting the band going, you just kind of walk outside and everyone's talking and happy, having a beer, having some wings, having some good food. Um, very exciting. The restaurant was packed before the game started a little after 7 p.m. Oh, and they're, well, they're coming in their jerseys, they got their caps on, the kids are all excited. I've seen a couple small baseball bats, right, and, and baseballs, because they're hoping to get them signed by the team, team members. Um, and everyone's just generally, they've been waiting all winter for these guys to get their, their first home game, so should be a good season. A Dayton resident who lives above Lock 27 marveled at the transformation the area has taken around the ballpark. You'll see families with two and three, four kids, uh, ranging from little kids up. So it's a nice, safe family affair uh, to come to enjoy the evening. Uh, if you want to party with your, your friends, uh, whether it's a party or a wedding or a, a banquet hall, I think it's just a lot of fun night. Uh, and it's a nice place to live. Should be a lot of fun for everyone near Day Air Ballpark this season. Reporting for Two News, I'm Seth Bird.